going on, y'all? You already know what it is. This is Tune In Sports. Let's talk about it, man. Let's talk about the Cavaliers, man. Um, I ain't going to spend too much time on this, man. But before I, I get ready to read these comments right here, man, I just want to say one thing. Uh, it's about damn time. It's about damn time. It's about time, man. <laughs> it's about time. We finally got to win. The Cavaliers finally got to win, man. I hear all that talk about LeBron James, you know, for Donovan Mitchell, man. Don't don't pay too much of that any attention, man. I know some of y'all want LeBron back. You got a fan base that don't want LeBron back. But don't pay no mind to that, man. That's Paul Pierce, you know, chatting at his finest. But I hear, I hear, I hear what he's trying to say. But um, anyway, man, um, it's about time, man. Um, but let me, let me, let me, let me get into it, man. I don't want to hold y'all too long, man. Uh, shout out to my dude, humble man, man. Shout out to humble man. We dialed in. Oh yeah, you already know. You already know, man. G League Grizzlies is a is a fact. <laughs> yeah, G League Grizzlies. Yeah, man. That's exactly who the Cavaliers is playing yesterday, man. They was playing the. The G League Grizzlies, man. You know? Is anybody surprised about what happened? No, man. Nope. Hey, oh, nope. Nope. Is anybody surprised about what happened? No, man. Nope. Hey, oh, nope. A game you supposed to win, man. I know they've been losing, but yeah, it's the it's the G League Grizzlies. So it's really no surprise, man. You know? Um Shout out to Thomas, man. Shout out to my guy, Thomas. He said Knicks are joining the three C, threatening the two C. A Magic Sports analyst guru said that what happened. Hey, man, look, you you said you said a lot of things, bro. You said a lot of things. I ain't gonna lie, but uh, the season ain't yet, man. Um, you said I told y'all to split that backcourt the f up and get OG or Caruso. Y'all hard headed. Nah, man. Um, the seat, like I said, like the season not over. The playoffs didn't even start yet. We almost, you know, gearing up for the playoffs. That conversation is not needed right now, man. He's splitting the backcourt up right now. Uh, that'd be a conversation, you know, um, in the future. Not right now, though. Probably during the offseason, depending on what happens, right? But I hear you, man. I, I like I said, I, yeah. OG uh, was a good pickup for the Knicks. Knicks made some good moves. I will say that about um the trash Knicks. They made some good moves, man. Um, <laughs> you said, oh, I make it so <laughs> Jeezy, yeah. <laughs> but hey, we'll hit the like button for y'all. Yeah, I appreciate you, bro. It's all good. <laughs> shout out to, uh, shout out to Thomas, man. Uh, Clippers fan and um, you know, Atlanta native and stuff, man. Ride with them Hawks too. Um. But like I said, man, I don't want to hold it too long, man. Uh, l l let's talk about the uh, the Cavaliers defeating the G League uh, Grizzlies, right? Um, they had guys like this out there, man. You know? <laughs> they had guys like this out here, man. You don't even see the stats. Like, what's going on? Like, who is this? <laughs> who is this guy, man? Look, everybody, look, everybody worried about playoffs and firing JB. Man, I'm just hoping to win a game, man. I was just hoping to win a game at this point because we just couldn't do that, man. You know, now I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to lie. I, I, I knew the Cavs, you know, they should win this game. But that first half, like, it had you thinking otherwise. Like, you know, first off, you could say it was it, it was kind of embarrassing at first because, First off, compared to us, this team, it's not good. That's garbage. That's garbage. I don't want to say they garbage, but, like, you, you, do you get what I'm trying to say, man? It's the Memphis Grizzlies. But it's not the Memphis Grizzlies. It's the G League Grizzlies. Yeah, Drake. <laughs> Drake. <laughs> the nigga that got bodied by Pusha T? The nigga that's hiding his kid from the world, but his world wanna hide from the kid? It's the G League Grizzlies, and also they was coming off a back-to-back -back 
They just lost to the Spurs by double digits. The Cavs are at home. And their whole team is on the injury report, man. Like, so it's like, who who are we playing at this point, right? Um, of course, Gigi was out there. I know Gigi, but who were we playing at this point? <laughs> who was they guard? Like, what where, where, where that button at? What about uh hold up, where that button at? Like who 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 was they playing at this point, man? And you know, shout shout out to them, man. Shout out to the, the G League Grizzlies, man. Um it was uh Scotty Pippen. I know Scotty Pippen Jr., man. He was he, you know, he out there doing a little something too, man. Shout out to Scotty Pippen. But I it's just like like do y'all know anybody that was out there? Yes. Go ahead. What do you mean? No, you, you, mean? you know what my question is. I asked you a direct now you stuttering. You taking time to Google it? Who was he going up against? Do y'all know do y'all know anybody else out there? I'm talking about to the casual fans, of course, man. Like, what more can I say, man? Um the Cavaliers, they was playing, you know, the Grizzly G League team, you know, a bunch of 10A contracts and two-way players and, and ball boys and and et cetera out there, man. You know what I mean? <laughs> And yet at halftime they was up fifty one to forty eight, and I'm talking about the Memphis, the Memphis Grizzlies. You know what I'm saying? Let me see what this say. He said, "He said, good to see Miss drop a nice thirty piece before the playoffs start." Um, he had thirty. No, nah, I think um, I think he had twenty nine. Did he have thirty? I got dope. Let me see. I think he had twenty nine. Humble. Let me double check. Did he have thirty? Nah, he had twenty nine. But I, I, I get what you're saying though. Yeah, yeah, close to thirty. I got you. Um, Spider had twenty nine, man. But yeah, it was nice to see uh Spider, you know, do what he do. You could tell like he still, <laughs> you could you could tell he still got the uh the, you know the injury right. He playing through the injury and he's not clearly a hundred percent. But it was nice to see that he he showed uh some flashes of you know of you know the the, the Spider we know. But he's not all the way there. Salute to Elyse, man. What's good, Elyse? Elyse, my fault. What's going on, man? Shout out to Elyse, bro. I just rounded it up. Yeah, for sure, for sure. But but the 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 Cavaliers played the G League Grizzlies. You had guys like Laravia. Laravia was out there, right? You had guys like Laravia. He was cooking us for the perimeter, man. Uh, twenty one points in the first half. And uh, he finished with a career high. I think it was a career high of thirty-two points. Like, yo, why, why, yo? Question: Why does it feel like nowadays players are setting records against the Cavaliers? Man, I know we're not the only one. We can't be the only one, but it feel like these, these, like, it's not just the players. It's like rookies and second-year type players. I don't know. I just don't like that, man. You had Brandon Miller score a career high on you and we end up taking an l in that game and we gotta we owe the we owe the hornets an l we gotta see the hornets again right um you even had your formal cavalier lamar stevens out there hitting threes he was hitting threes on us like dude we need you to do that when you was here wow <laughs> why you didn't do that when you was here man you know we had lamar stevens out there hitting three like Lamar Stevens has been shooting the ball better, man. And you know, he's a he was a fan favorite um here. But yeah, Lamar Stevens out there shooting threes. I'm like, wow. <laughs> I said, wow, it's one of them games. Shame. I said it's one of them games, man. He said Elise said he didn't do that just against the Lakers and Clippers. <laughs> Oh, he talk. He talk about. <laughs> Wait, he talk. He talk about. He talk about Spider. <laughs> he talk about Spider Man. Let me see. He said. Uh, <laughs> he said. Side note: Grizzly and D Rose don't mix. You know, in college, the boys shake my head. I thought D Rose going to the. He still with Memphis. I thought D Rose going to Memphis was a good thing. Um, you know, as far as the, uh, being a vet and um. You know, especially with uh, John Moran and stuff. Um, all them players hurt though. They they whole roster is out. They on an injury report. Like, it's crazy. It's crazy. 
He said, he least said, we, we got that pattern as well. <laughs> I don't like these front, those front runs. Now nah, I feel, <laughs> now nah, I feel you. So yeah, you talking about Spider, right? You you said he's a talented offensive player, none, none less. You you talking about Spider? Now nah, I feel you. I feel you. Uh, I know the the league is um is different. You know, yeah, 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 yeah. He dealing, yeah, he dealing with knee injury. Now nah, honestly though, honestly, shout out to my yeah, shout out to my guy Spider, man. Um. Honestly though, the the G League, the Grizzlies, they was hanging around, right? They was hanging around um the game, man. Um the Cavaliers didn't come out with the since we're talking about oh, yeah, they didn't come out with the energy I expected them to come out with. They ended up just going 16 at second quarter. Um but my guy Spider, you know, Spider, the best for me, he's the best two guard in the world, man, in, in this NBA today. Um I feel like he set the tone for us, man. Um, you know, with them 19 points, I thought it was impactful. Uh, first minutes of the game, he gave you some productive minutes. I was like, oh yeah, bro, he's cooking. Um, cause you know he haven't really been um a shell of himself. You get what I'm saying? So I, I oh, what's good? What's good, Pagan? Shout out to Pagan. Shout out to Pagan 180. Shout out to Pagan Clip Nation. Um. You said no. You said no excuse. You said no excuse. Kobe played through an ankle, knee, shoulder, pinky finger, on shooting. Nah, yeah, yeah. Kobe. I mean, yeah. Kobe is a different breed, man. <laughs> Kobe's definitely a different breed, man. That's why Kobe is uh re- respected. And, you know, he's he's highly respected, man. Um, people that not even Kobe fans respect Kobe, right? Uh, I, I got a lot of respect for Kobe, even though I wasn't a big Kobe fan, but um. Yeah, that Kobe, yeah, Kobe was different, man. And the mama mentality, yeah, dudes don't got that. Dudes, there's a lot of dudes you can say they don't got that. They don't got that dog. They don't have. They don't have that will. So you can you can say that about some players. But I, I spider man, I can't. Nah, I spider that dude, man. I don't know, man. Um, I yeah yeah definitely. As you as you should, you should hold you should hold these players to high yeah high high standards, especially these star players. Um. What's good, Ghana? You said you opened the trade in one, one of Allen or Diamond or Garland. Something has to get, to be honest. I don't know if the double bid can work consistently. Um, man, I'm not at that point yet. I like I'm not uh I'm not at that point for the conversation yet. I want to see what happened in the playoffs. I know like the double big lineup, like as you if you notice JB um don't play them like that at the same time, like he's staggered eight minutes out. Um, I, I definitely, I, I definitely not a, like too much of a fan of that big thing, man, you, you know, but Mobley has been working on his spacing also, man. I think, I think, I think that's a JB problem, man, but I, 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 man, you said Trey one Allen or Don McGarland. It, it did, look, I don't want to have that conversation right now. I want to see what happened in the playoffs. Um, even though I don't have us, you know, going far in the playoffs, but um, yeah, I I know I know the person that will like if, when it comes to results happen if the cast flame out, uh, the the first person to, to be ready to uh, be on the out would probably be JB, um, the head coach, and then um, then you probably talk about trading some players, right? Um, it all depends. You know, it depends what Donovan do with the extension, and then it depends how you feel about the backcourt, man. Can the backcourt work? <laughs> I don't know, man. Like, like, like the size thing. Like the the size is definitely a, a thing, right? That size. Cavaliers is kind of small, bro. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not. I'm not even gonna lie to you, man. Elise said yes. I'm talking about Spider, man. <laughs> yeah, hey, Elise, you think? Ah man, Spider man. I don't know, man. I like I like Spider man. Spider is a dog. Spider got that dog in him. I, I respect Spider man. Spider Spider playing through an injury right now. I be I, I I don't know, man. Spider got that dog in him, man. Um, Ghana says someone has to be benched for fluid. I hear yo. I hear you, man. I hear you. Um, some people say one of them guys gotta come off the bench, like um. What's good, out, man? What's going on, bro? 
blow out the Hornets last game. Yeah, I, I hope that that would be lovely, man. Especially what happened last time. Um, ended on ended on a a good note, man. We got the Pacers next up too, man. Um, we need to see if they trying to get it back in blood. Yeah, we know. I, I definitely want to punch the Hornets in their face. I definitely. <laughs> Definitely gotta get some get back, man. We we gotta we gotta put something on them, man. You know what I mean? Um, uh, I mean, let me answer this one more comment before I get back into uh, get back to the Grizzlies, the G League Grizzlies. You said Ghana said, who do you think steps up in the playoffs, or who do you need to? Yo, honestly, um, Ghana, yo, the I mean, the obvious answer would be everybody needs to step up, but. With Donovan having this knee injury, um, and I, I don't, I don't, I expect Donovan to, to to show up. Um, even with this injury, I expect him to, you know, be Donovan. Not, not, not a hundred percent. I don't know what it's going to be look like, but I expect Donovan to do whatever he got to do. It's the other guys that got to step up. It's not Donovan. It's the role players and his, um, I guess you could say his Robin. If you want to call Darius Garland his Robin, like. Darius Garland got to step up. Um, the whole up and down type of games, like one minute you out here looking like a shell of yourself, then the next minute you don't look like nothing. You 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 you're passing, you're not taking certain shots. Um, I don't know. I think Darius got to step up. You need your scorers out there. Darius gonna have to step up. You need your shooters out there to perform. Max Schuess gonna have to sh shoot that ball. Like you're gonna have to have one of the moments. Um. Niang got to got to step up, man. Niang ain't really been doing none these last couple of games. He got to definitely step up off the, coming off that bench. He got to prove that he can stay on the floor and not get played off the floor because we know his defense. Um, who else? Lavert got to step up. Lavert been kind of <laughs> Lavert been kind of like iffy, man. He been iffy. He been shaky. Um. Yeah, and, and and Mo, you know the bigs. We'll, we'll see what happens, man. But I, yeah, mostly everybody. But yeah, I think Darius and Mobley definitely got to step up. Mobley got to continue to 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 you know shoot that ball, shoot that three ball, and be aggressive coming into these playoffs. Um, I don't think I'm really worried about him on the defense. Um, my defense got to step up. As that's as a whole too. Our defense, the coach got to step up. You know what I'm saying, Ghana? Like. You know, you know what I mean. So it's like, yeah. You said, let me, let me read. Yeah, last one. You said, do you think Imani gets some Bernie's next few games? I mean, it's only two games left, right? Um, it's possible. I mean, last night, uh, Pete Nance and everybody got in the game. So, um, but you saying burn? So burn means like actually playing. <laughs> do I think he actually gonna play? I'm gonna say no, but but is it possible he get in? Sure, but actually playing, I don't. I don't think he actually gonna get like the burn you think he gonna get, right? And shout out to Imani. I think he'll get in a game like Pete Nance and Craig Porter and Isaiah Mobley. But playing wise, I don't think he gonna get burned. We trying to, we trying to work on the seeding right now. We trying to uh, secure our, uh, you know, a spot in the playoffs and win these last couple games. But um, but yeah, man, like uh. D, D Mitch, you know, I thought he was I thought he he was solid this game, man. Um it was up three at the half, like I said. Uh LaRavia was 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 killing it. Um it was it was definitely a back and forth game. Probably something you don't want <laughs> as a cast fan and versus the Grizzlies, but uh I all I can say is they handle their business, right? Uh the Cavs beat the Grizzlies 110 to 98. Um one thing I liked in the first half, well, one thing I liked, you know, the Cavaliers, they got to the line. They got to the line 12 times. Overall, they got to the line 29 times. They 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 they, they shot 29 free throws. They shot 29 free throws, my fault. Um, and Mobley, he had eight points, three blocks, two steals, and eight rebounds at the half. Um, <laughs> you know, um, with Mobley, uh, somebody called them um, – <laughs> It was something on on Twitter, man. They call him somebody called him Derek Favors. <laughs> they 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 said Evan Mobley. I think Derek. Fav they call him Derek Favors now. I think I, I think that's a thing, right? That dude started that up. 
Um, <laughs> I don't know why, yo. That, that Derek Favors is crazy, man. Um, well, Derek Favors, <laughs> Derek Favors Mobley. Yeah, that's what they call him, right? Um, he had, he also had two three pointers in this game, man. Um, right now he's shooting thirty eight percent from the three. Um, that's good. That's the highest he been. That's the highest he been shooting, it, right? I know he's not taking that many attempts, but he's shooting the ball uh pretty well. And as a Cavs fan, you you love to see that, man. Uh, we spoke about him extending the range and you know what that could mean for the Cavs. But that that Dag Favors comment, man. They call him Dag Favors, man. That's crazy. <laughs> 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 Call them dang favors, bro. That's crazy, man. You said, bro, you would have died on Mitchell says it's crazy to be. What yo, what you mean, Elise? No, that's not what I <laughs> That's not what I'm saying, Elise. <laughs> that's not what I'm saying, man. You said so the whole team got stuff except the best player. No, the best player gotta step up. The best player, the, your best player always got to show up, man. No, the best player don't get a pass. I'm not giving Donovan a pass. I'm just saying, like, how, how can I say it? Um, I'm not saying I'm saying, like, I don't know. Of course, I don't know what's going to happen in the playoffs, but I expect Donovan to, you know, show up. It's the other guys, man, that got to, you know what I mean, that got to show because because they haven't been – they haven't been showing up throughout this. Like, it's been ups and downs this season with these guys, man. And just going off last year also, man, these, these guys got to show up this year. You can't have a, you can't have another the likes are too bright moment from Jared Allen. You, you get what I'm saying? Like, Donovan got to show up for sure. I'm just saying, like, um, I'm just, yeah, I mean, at the end of the day, the team, the team got to show up too. You know what I mean? He leaves, you got a point. A lot of stars on this team. Everybody got to do their part. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not excluding Donovan out. Um, of course, the best player, like, yeah, nah, I'm not giving him a pass. Like, he got to show up, man. I know he last season, he ain't, I mean, last playoffs, he, he wasn't that. He played like, played like crap. I know, I already know. Um, but you say what was good? Uh, they gotta figure this this shit out. Oh, we cook. Um, yeah, man. Um, like I said, man. Um, I'm I'm gonna stay confident, man. Um, I'm gonna stay confident, this group, man. JB, you know, he started like coaching on the camera. Did I read mean that? He says I the coach on the chemistry when everybody's on the floor together, man. Yeah, you you just hope that the Cavs, you you just hoping they go into this playoffs and and you just hope they could just, you know what I'm saying? Like, um JB, he went eight deep this game, and um Lavert and Yang gonna curl off the bench. Those guys also gotta, you know, show up. You didn't get too much scoring in the in the uh from them in the first half. No minutes from uh Morris Senior. Sam was out with a neck injury. That's another guy I would like to see in the playoffs. Um, I think he got a neck injury from that Clippers game, I believe. Um, Morris not playing is not a big deal to me. I do think he will probably see you know sometime in the po postseason or whatever. Um, you know wh whoever we play, I do think. We will see uh Morris in the playoffs, man. But he, you know, it's not a big deal. He had, he didn't really play. Um, uh, but it looked like JB's clamping down on the rotation as we approach postseason. Lavert was the leading scorer off the bench. Um, he had 18 points, two steals, two assists on 28 minutes, and he went two for four from the three, which is cool. Um, I don't I don't like when Lavert is just jacking up shots or jacking up too many threes you know unless he's cooking but sometimes he feel like sometimes Levert feel like he got the high hand he gets trigger happy sometimes some of the moves some of the decisions Levert be making I'm like yo chill 
And hopefully by the playoffs, he's good. Because I haven't really been too impressed this year. Like, I've been, at, like, as far as, like, the the offense, like, for his mid-range shot, I don't know, man. I don't know about LeVert mid-range shot. Because that's part of his game. Like, he can give it to you in the mid-range. But like, he's been missing his mid-range shots just for, like, you know, um, maybe I'm tripping. But, you know, LeVert, that's, that's another guy that got to, you know, show up coming off that bench, man. But, um. I ain't going to lie. Sometimes I get nervous when LeVert be, you know, <laughs> with the ball sometimes, man. I get nervous. Uh, you got LeVert trying to force passes inside uh, the paint to the bigs. Like, you just – I don't know. You never know with LeVert, man. But um, Okoro, he got 27 minutes. Um, I didn't have no problem, you know, with your one of your, your best perimeter defender again, you know, those type of minutes. Because you always want defense on the floor, especially against the top players. Um, And the Yang, I feel like – when the Yang, he will show up in the playoffs. Uh, I don't want to speak too much about him. You know, I, I, he got to show up. I know he ain't he ain't really been performing offensively. You know, giving you them them um them shots you're looking for. But it would be nice if him and our shooters are going into the playoffs. You know, clicking. Um, let me see. Hey, I'm uh I met um. Just in a lane, bro. I'm a uh I'm a what we what we got? We got uh Damn, hold on, let me see. Hold up. Cause I got a um can't play the piece. I don't I don't know about today, I mad cause I got a um I actually got a slide somewhere, man. Um, I got I got you on the next stream, my man. I got I, I drop I'm gonna drop the link on the next stream. I actually got a uh, slide somewhere, man. That's why I just want to have you ever get in here. Talk quick about the Grizzly and the Cavs, man. But um, I got I got you on, I got you on the next one, man. But um, to sum it up, man, with this game, man, it's it's the Grizzlies, and a win is a win. Um, you needed some type of boost going into this next game, which could be a playoff type feel. Uh, you are gonna be home. Um, and this might be a potential playoff matchup, you know, against the Pacers. Um, Donovan Mitchell, he's not a hundred percent. Okay, he's not a hundred percent. Um, but he looked better in this game. And yes, Donovan do have to show up in the playoffs, man. You gotta show up. It starts with your your best player, man, your leader. Um he don't get a pass. I'm not saying that. Um, but the game, you know, he 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 had some moments. Um, in this game, um, all I can say is like, you know, they picked it up in the second half. It was pretty much a you know a little balanced scoring, you know, from everybody. And with Donovan being a scoring leader, of course, man. But uh, it's the it's the Grizzlies. It's the, it's the G League Grizzlies, and um, <laughs> I expected them to win this game, man. So uh, the next the, the next game. Is the Pacers and that's game I gotta like, gotta see what they do in that game, man. Um, hopefully they come out with a, you know some 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 good energy, and um you know, do what they gotta do, man. But um, but that whole, but nah, I'm not giving um, nah, man, that's, nah, because you know it's you know that everybody gotta show up, man. But it's just like them 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 guys right there, like. It's important for them to show up. Like, what happened when Donovan is, is getting blitzed and stuff like that? You know, like, Darius got to step up, man. Them other guys got to step up, you know. But, um, but yeah, man. I, I Yeah. But we good, though, man. Um, we good. So sorry, man. Yeah, I got yeah, I got man. Yeah. Ne yeah, ne next next stream. Next stream. Next stream. Next stream, man. But we gonna be we gonna be good, man. Um no trade talks. Chill with the trade talks right now, man. We not there yet, man. The playoffs didn't even start yet. Let's chill with the trade talks. Let's chill with the LeBron for Donovan Mitchell stuff. Let's 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 chill on all that, man. You know, let's let's chill with that, man. <laughs> LeBron for Donovan Mitchell. That's crazy. Um LeBron is a Laker, Donovan is a Cavalier. That's how it is right now, man. And um, 
Hey, yeah, man. But yeah. Um, shout out to everybody, you know. You know, shout out to everybody on the playback. Shout out to everybody on um Twitter and YouTube, everybody in the chat, man. Um, make sure you drop a like for your boy, man. Um, let's let let's keep on going. Um, I still have faith in this team. Let's let, let let's close out, man. Let's close these last two games out, man. I believe this team could do it, man. Um, then you know we we just take a game by a game, you know, take one step at a time, man. Um, and yeah, y'all already know, man. Let them know. Go Cavs, man. With the 49th pick in the 2023 NBA Draft, the Cleveland Cavaliers select Imani Bates from Eastern Michigan University. lesson learning our lesson and then applying all the things that we talked about the effort that you guys put in on the defensive end of the floor was phenomenal okay that was textbook Cavaliers defense and then the offensive end of the floor we shared it we attacked the paint we got what we wanted okay that was a phenomenal job Congratulations to this group okay, for achieving something as a unit that we've never done before. Okay, but we ain't done yet. All right, let's go. Yes, sir.